tonight. I don't know what it is, whether it's the time of the year. Hell, it is October, which means we just came out of an incredibly successful fast lane and are well on our way to Crown Jewel. And then just around the corner, it is Survivor Series. And it all starts right here tonight at the season premiere of SmackDown! Now, I came out here tonight to call attention to one of the unsung heroes of WWE. He's in the ring with me right now. He doesn't know why I asked him out here. But not only did he have an incredibly successful career as an in-ring performer, but Adam Pearce, over the last three years, Adam Pearce, over the last three years as a WWE official, has done an incredible job doing a very thankless job. He has managed the superstars of Raw, of SmackDown. He has overseen both shows, and he has done an incredible job. And for that, Adam, I say thank you. And with that in mind, that job is incredibly difficult, and it is a job that no one person should do alone. So with that, I am very happy to tell you, you will no longer be alone. And I'm also happy to tell you that as of this moment, you, Adam, are getting a promotion. As of right now, Adam Pierce is now the new general manager of Monday Night Raw. Which leads me to who will be the general manager of SmackDown. Is Dirty Dom the general manager? No way. This is so Hold on. Are you serious? Fastlane was not. A tremendous success. The Judgment Day got screwed out of their tag team titles. Like I said, the Judgment Day got screwed out of their tag team titles, and now Jay and Cody... I'm sorry, Dominic, I'm sorry. I cannot hear you with that. Uh, it just, it's, it... If you could please, please just keep it down. No, Dominic, go ahead. Like I was saying... Jay and Cody are defending our titles tonight when the Judgment Day has a tag team title match. Get the guy in! When the Judgment Day have a tag team title match on Monday. So how could you allow him to do this? Wow, first of all, wow. I always thought they were pumping in that noise. I didn't realize how loud it actually was when you were out here. Not a lot of people know this about me, but I have a large history as a lip reader, and I believe what you were saying was something about injustice 
of the Tag Team Championships. They shouldn't be defending them tonight because there's a tag team match on Monday? Is that the gist of it? Gotcha. Well, here's the thing, Dominic. Um, you're yelling at the wrong people. As I just said, this is the GM of Monday Night Raw. You need to be talking to the general manager of SmackDown, so let me bring him out here, Mr. Nick Aldis. Oh, wow. Wow is right. Nick's had an exceptional career in the sports entertainment industry. He's been in the ring with a who's who. Well, first of all, I'd like to thank WWE for the opportunity of a lifetime to be the general manager of the number one sports entertainment brand in the world today, SmackDown. And Adam, I look forward to some healthy competition between our two brands. Me too. And Dom, good to meet you. I'm a big fan yeah, I'm a champion. of your dad. I'm going to cut right to the chase. As many of you know, about a month ago, Cody Rhodes was instrumental in a deal that took Jay Uso to Monday Night Raw. And in exchange, a Raw superstar must now come to SmackDown. So as my first official act, with Triple H's blessing, I'd like to introduce SmackDown's newest superstar, right now. Nobody cares. Well, I'm sorry, what was your name? Nick? Hold on, I don't think yours is working. Use this one. What was your name? Nick? Like, like you just said. Like I said, uh, we'll, we'll get to that at another moment, but if you don't mind, right now, the business at hand is SmackDown's newest superstar. I don't care who it is, I will, s I will slap him and I will make him respect me.